Neighborhood Hero, sponsored by B2EDI. Today is a day all about reflecting on what we're thankful for. And whether you think about it or not, you're probably very thankful to have a shower and be able to use it whenever you want. Unfortunately, this isn't everyone's reality. But this month's Neighborhood Hero, leader of Huntsville Shower Up, aims to fix just that. With a special Happy Thanksgiving to this month's hero, let's take the chance to meet Taylor Reed. The familiar sound. A sound that many don't even think about taking for granted. We definitely take showers for granted because we can get one every day or multiple times a day. Nonprofit organization Shower Up services six cities, Huntsville being one of them. Shower Up provides mobile showers and personal care for those experiencing homelessness. Personally, I mean, I've, I've never seen a truck with a, a shower in it that's uh, movable. Most of the time, we hop out of the shower feeling like a brand new person. When you have new and you put on new, you feel better. When you feel good, you do better. When I feel dirty, I, I don't feel myself. I feel kind of grumpy, mean kind of feel. Uh, but once I get a shower, I feel brand new, almost like Jesus, you know, just, just coming out of the water and feeling new and fresh, you know. And it's a good feeling, a really good feeling. But team leader of Huntsville Shower Up and this month's neighborhood hero, Taylor Reed, knows that showers only go skin deep. I mean, a shower is a great thing. You feel good about yourself, you can clean off, but you're going to need a shower again tomorrow. Um, it's really about making relationships with these individuals. He also knows showering these folks with grace, hope, and love is the real mission here. I just got baptized, um, talking about him being a hero. He literally physically baptized me himself. Uh, he put a little spark in me to help the shower up. I, I volunteered for them. This drive to serve comes from a place within Reed. Just over a decade ago, Reed and his family were greatly impacted by the tornado outbreak of 2011. I did lose my house um, in the tornadoes in 2011, living in Harvest, and lost everything. So I know what it's like to have nothing. Um, I know what it's like to go a little while without taking a shower. Um, and so uh, I, I, on some level, uh, have some familiarity with what it's like to, to be homeless. After that, he changed. He would always think of others first before himself, and he would always want to help people. If he saw somebody on the street, he would always want to roll down his window and give them money or give them something that they needed. And it's so cool driving around Huntsville. Um, you know, as the city grows, all the people who do not have housing, a lot of times they're walking around on the streets. And uh, every day I'll pass somebody, roll the window down, and yell their name, and wave at them. And uh, you know, you just—they're your friends in the community, and that's what it's all about. Um, it's helping my friends and those in our community who don't have showers get a shower. And although a shower isn't a fix-all solution, tell me, when was the last time you stepped out of one, feeling worse? With this month's Neighborhood Hero, I'm Nixon Norman, Fox 54 News. It was so nice meeting Taylor, and if you have a Neighborhood Hero in mind that you would like to nominate, go for it. To do so, head on over to our website, look for the Neighborhood Heroes tab, and nominate them. You never know, your Neighborhood Hero could be next.